Hi guys! I always get, you can probably tell in my voice, a little congested this time of year. So when I saw these shower steamers, I couldn't wait to give them a try. Ooh, what do you think of that? Today I'm going to show you how to make these basically bath bombs for the shower with just a few simple ingredients. Wow! Here's what you'll need to get started. Citric acid, baking soda, cornstarch, rubbing alcohol, castor oil, eucalyptus or another essential oil, soap colorant or food coloring, and a mold. First we're going to mix our dry ingredients except for the citric acid. We need 16 ounces of baking soda, which is exactly how much this box is, so I'm gonna pour it right in, a quarter cup of cornstarch, and two teaspoons of mica powder or soap colorant. You can also use food coloring, but if you go that route, wait and add it with your wet ingredients. Then give it a whisk until you get all the lumps out. I'm gonna add a little more color to darken it up. Now for our wet ingredients, we're gonna add two tablespoons of rubbing alcohol, two teaspoons of castor oil or carrier oil, then 20 to 30 drops of your essential oil. I'm using eucalyptus and lavender essential oils for their decongestant properties. And then mix everything together until all the ingredients are well incorporated. Now for our final ingredient, we're gonna add eight ounces of citric acid. The citric acid is the ingredient that creates the fizz. That's why we add it at the end so that it doesn't react with our wet ingredients. You'll know you have the right consistency when you can pick some up in your hand and it holds its shape. And now we're ready to put our mixture into the oven. Can we mix them all to D2 ones? Sure. <laughs> These are so cute. Okay. I've lost my helper, but I'm going to fulfill his special request. And we're gonna just scoop our mixture. You're gonna wanna pack it in as densely as possible. We have a special guest who showed up. Me! <laughs> Are you gonna help? Yeah. Okay, I want to scoop the big old two things. Okay. Everything down. And pat it all down. Little old two babies are so cute. Our molds look great. Now we're gonna leave them to dry for about 30 minutes. All right, everything should be dry. And now for the fun part, we're gonna pop them out. Oh my gosh, this turned out so cute. Do you wanna try? So I'm a little worried about R2-D2. Uh-oh, R2-D2 was a fail, but... We can try to remake it. So this is like a half of a bath bomb and you can set it in the bottom of the shower and everything will fizz and the effervescent vapors will come up into your nose and decongest you. Mmm, that actually smells amazing. You can get really creative and make these in different colors or customize them for different holidays or themes. And the best part is they're safe for the whole family. Ready for my shower! Mommy, it's melting. Whoa! All right, guys, we had so much fun making these, and I swear they really helped with my congestion. Tell me in the comments below what other DIYs you'd like to see, and we'll see you soon. Bye, Bye guys! guys. Yeah. I have no dream of